During the pandemic, many pastimes were put on hold, including weekly trips to the library for one six year old girl. Her name is Egypt Bush, and she decided I'm going to take matters into my own hands. And instead of going to read books, I'll write a series of books. My dad is a superhero. He gets everyone to where they need to go. My mom is a superhero. She saves lives every day. Well now, a lot of superheroes around Egypt. She may be little, but she has big hopes that her books will inspire generations to come. And what perfect timing, because today is Book Lovers Day. Six-year-old Egypt and her dad, Raheem Bush, join us this morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So, Egypt, first of all, I have to tell you happy belated birthday. I heard you just celebrated your sixth birthday. When was your birthday? It was 25th October. Well, look at you. How was it? Good. Good for you. Okay, so you used to go to the library to get bedtime stories. Then the library shut down because we're in the middle of a pandemic. You couldn't go anymore. What'd you decide to do? Mm -hmm. so my dad read my... Re reading my books over and over and over again. And we were only stuck with two books. They had to read them over and over again. Then after that, he said, Egypt, why don't you make your own book? And then there we go. And then there we, we got go. Superhero Town. Then we got Superhero Town. Now, Dad, I heard her when she was reading say, Dad is my superhero. How does that make you feel? It makes me feel amazing that she sees me as a superhero. I'm sure. So how many books so far do we have? So, so far we have three reading books and one activity and coloring book. Nice. Now, Egypt, can you tell me, aside from, I know the title Superhero Town, what are these books about? So, Superhero Town is about people turning superheroes to like coronavirus. Superhero family is about family and all my parents have been jobs. Mm. And then Superhero school is about school and all awesome things that you can be when you grow up. Look at you, Egypt. Now, I am a little bit older than you, Egypt, but I would venture to say that I love coloring books just as much as you do. Do you think I should get a coloring book that you made? Mm -hmm. so, what? <laughs> so what? <laughs> Dad, it's so the kid what? in me, you know, want to color and do fun stuff and, and fun things. How proud of you like um, are, are you of her? I mean, it's amazing, you know, just watching her sell her books. And now she's talking about she wants to give away 2,000 books for the Christmas season Aww. for kids who, who don't have uh, gifts because of the pandemic. I mean, it's a, it's, a, it's a wonderful thing as a dad. Well, let's give you some credit. Ow. You raised her right. Um, where can people buy these books? All right, so the books are available at beingegypt.com. And um, they can also donate if they want to help us reach our goal of 2,000 books. Egypt, you have your own website, girlfriend? Uh -huh. Being and Egypt. Instagram. Tell them your Instagram. Being Egypt. Being Egypt on the gram. Okay. Um, I also am very impressed. So you want to give some books away, Egypt? Tell me about why you want to do that. Because it's fun to give away books. Aww. And I want to show my followers and books because they want to help people that don't have any presents and they can't afford any stuff. You're so sweet. Do you, are you gonna write any more books, Egypt? Yes, oh. uh, I've already written a book about me and my pop named London. Well, excuse me, girlfriend. Raheem Bush, Egypt Bush, thank you so much. Thank Keep you. Keep up the good work. Thank you. All right, yes, we'll we look for you, you on the gram. Bye, Egypt. Okay. okay. Have a good day, guys. You too. Have a good day. <laughs>